Okay, lesson 15-3, analyze and compare quadrilaterals. So we wanna have our comp book out to help us with this. Okay. So we have our comp book to help us out with this one, okay? So we have a square, a rectangle, a parallelogram, a trapezoid, and a rhombus. So what has one pair of parallel lines? So look down in here. Trapezoid. So a trapezoid has one pair of parallel lines. So that would be this one because this is parallel to that. But see how these are shooting outward like that? These are closer down here than they are there. Therefore, they're not the same distance apart all the way through. So that's, it only has one pair of parallel lines. Blank and blank are parallelograms with four right angles. Okay, so a parallelogram with the right angle is a rectangle. And a rectangle with equal sides is a square. So the square is gonna have right angles also. So this would be a rectangle and a square are parallelograms with four right angles. Blank and blank are parallelograms with all sides the same length. So the if they're the same length, okay, that's congruent sides here. So that's a square is gonna have congruent sides and a rhombus is gonna have congruent sides. So if we look here, all four sides are the same length right there and same with our rhombus. These are all the same length. It's just like a square that's been pushed sideways, okay? So a square and a rhombus are parallelograms with all sides the same length. Okay, complete the statements below to name the shape that is not a parallelogram or a trapezoid. Okay, so parallelograms have two pairs of parallel sides, okay? That means that this side, these two over here, are parallel and then those two are parallel. We have two sides in a parallelogram here. We got this side and this side and then we have that side and that side. They're, they're parallel to each other, two pairs. So shapes, which of these shapes have, this is parallel with this and that is parallel with that, okay? So A definitely, okay? This is parallel to this, but this is not parallel to this line. Look at the distance between them apart right here compared to up here. This one slants up. So B is not a parallelogram, okay? Um, D is, these sides are the same. The top and the bottom are the same. These are definitely not parallel to each other. E, these, these are the same and those are the same. And not the same, but parallel. These are parallel. And those are parallel, okay? So those are parallelograms. Trapezoids have one pair of parallel signs. So trapezoid, one pair of parallel sides. It's a trapezoid, just like this. Oops. Whoa. Sorry about that. That was quite the spill. Got a little excited about my trapezoid there, I think. Okay, seems a little unable to focus. Okay, there we go. I think we're back to good new. Woo. Okay, so trapezoid only has one pair of parallel lines, which is this one right here, because these are parallel, but this top is not parallel with that. So shape B is a trapezoid. The only shape that is not a parallelogram or a trapezoid is the one we did not list, which would be this one, okay? It does not have, there isn't any lines that are parallel. That is definitely not parallel with that. It's just kind of a mess. So that does not fit into either category of parallelogram or trapezoid. All right, complete the statements below to name the shape that is a rhombus, but not a rectangle. Okay, rhombuses 
Now take a look at what a rhombus is. It's like a square that's been pushed sideways. So it's a parallelogram and all four sides are congruent, which means the same length. So let's look for the ones that are rhombuses. Okay, this has all four sides have to be the same length. Okay, so I would say these, A and E, both of those are rhombuses. All four sides are the same length, okay? Rectangles have four angles. Of the shape that are rhombuses, so we're looking at A and E, only shape blank is a rectangle. Okay, rectangles must have four right angles. This does not have right angles. That's huge, that's small, that's huge, that's small, okay? This has four right angles. You can tell because they're making, the lines are making like an L right there, okay? So shape E is a rectangle. So of A and E, which one is a rhombus but not a rectangle? It should be shape A. Okay, name the shapes that are parallelograms but not rectangles. You kind of have to look over here. Okay, so we want something that's a parallelogram but it's not a rectangle. So the only thing left would be a square or a rhombus because those two are shooting off of the parallelogram, but it's not a rectangle. And any square is a rectangle. It might just have to be the rhombus. Let's see what we have. So a square is a rectangle. Remember that? A square is a rectangle because it has four straight lines and four straight angles, right? Two, and two sets of parallel lines. So it has to be a rhombus. So it's, a rhombus is gonna have four equal sides. I'm gonna say this is a rhombus. It's really the only one. Because a square is also a rectangle. So it has to be a rhombus. Okay, good job. See you tomorrow.